Okay, so this is a quick addition to my export into Dropbox video. So if you're trying to share your videos with people on a PC or on a Mac that perhaps doesn't have Final Cut Pro installed or an older Mac, then you need to make sure that you're setting up your export file correctly. So when you go to the share button across here to the left and you're exporting out a master file, then you need to jump into the, the settings here and just make sure that you're exporting out in a video codec that will be readable by a wide number of computers. And so the H.264 video codec is the best one to go for. Um, if you're exporting out or editing in Apple ProRes, then not all computers have Apple ProRes installed, especially PCs or other operating systems, okay, or tablets or such like. So make sure that you're exporting out as H.264 and then dropping it into your Dropbox folder or saving it and sharing it on another share system such as Google Drive and the H.264 video codec should work on most people's computers as long as they've got the, the basic QuickTime player installed. Okay, so that's a quick tip for exporting out from Final Cut Pro 10 and sharing it as widely as possible with people who need to see the video file. The H.264 codec also will keep a reasonably good quality as well, but keep the file size down too, which is also an advantage of that file format too.